We wanted to know who helps the people who don't get into a shelter. So our reporter Leslie Delisbore joined a street outreach team serving people who are out in the elements on this dangerously cold night. While the snow and ice are thick, the layers for some of these people are thin. Hey, did you want to come down? You want to come down? So the priority for Anton Washington and others is giving out items to the homeless community, braving these elements when shelters are no longer an option. Whether it's a hat, whether it's a glove, whether it's some thick socks, a uh, scarf, whether it's a log they can burn. Most shelters don't accept men. It's women and children, and especially people not within the LGBTQIA community, and also their beds are full. It's not enough of them. But it's this type of outreach that can go a long way for people surviving the cold, something State Representative Michael Johnson says is a problem. This is, to me, considered a state of emergency. It's an epidemic when you have to be out in this type of uh, the inclements and the severity of this weather. And so I'm not blaming anyone, but what I want to do is make sure that we come together and fix it. For now, Anton says it's important for the community to remember those who are in the shadows trying to stay warm. As you sleep at nighttime, guess what happens? You know, somebody out here can be actually losing their life because their heart rate stops. In Kansas City, Leslie Delisborg, KSHB 41 News. If you or someone you know needs access to a low barrier shelter, the city of Kansas City has a list of access sites and referral based sites. There's also a hotline number listed on your screen that you can call as part of the city's cold weather plan. That number is 816-513-3699.